Hello, happy Easter. Um, some of you may have noticed, if you're paying very careful attention, that um, I haven't really put out a video of anything in about a week, um, except for on the Facebook. We did, um, obviously, the, the Triduum liturgies. We've done, we've been doing daily mass every day, obviously, and I did one on um, after the Easter Vigil, because I messed up the Easter Vigil live streaming, so uh, you might have noticed that, but I haven't done anything here, just kind of talking for a couple of days, uh, for, like I said, for about a week, and there's, uh, there's a reason for that, or a couple reasons for that. One, um, because uh, we were kind of busy with the with the Triduum and kind of planning those liturgies, setting those up, kind of figuring how we were going to do them uh, without any servers, you know, without a congregation in the chapel, which we don't we normally don't do. Uh, and so there are a couple kind of uh, things we had to figure out with that, but also because I was um, actually sick for the most of last week, I had what turned out to be a sinus infection. Uh, so I. Uh, so, uh, so I was, I was able, I, I wasn't that, it wasn't that bad, but I was, I, I didn't want, I wasn't talking a whole lot because it was a sinus infection, you know, that was up in here and then it kind of went down into my throat and everything else. Um, it was really actually, it was kind of interesting because, um, I went, it was getting kind of, it, it started, la uh, you know, around Palm Sunday, maybe the, uh, the Saturday before around that evening. And it was getting kind of steadily worse and worse and worse and worse over the week until Wednesday, till last Wednesday, uh, Wednesday of Holy Week, I decided to go to the urgent care. And I've, I'm, I'm not somebody who goes to the doctor very often, but I've been to the urgent care before, uh, just down the road. And normally when you go to the urgent care, you know, you in the parking lot, you walk in, you sign in, and you know you wait to go see a doctor or a nurse or a PA or something. Um, this time, there's a big, for those of you who, if you haven't been you know, to do a round of the doctor for anything lately, there's a big sign, um, like a big sign in front of the door saying, basically, do not come in, uh, stay in your car, schedule an appointment online. So I went to the car, uh, scheduled a little appointment on the, uh, on the phone, waited about... 15, 20 minutes for somebody to call, they kind of they asked me, so what's wrong with you? And I said, you know, I kind of explained what was wrong. I said, it's really bad allergies, and I think it led to a sinus infection. And then they kind of interrogated me and grilled me for a while about uh, coronavirus. Have I been around anybody who has coronavirus? Have I been to New York? Have I been out of the country? Uh, have I, do I have a cough? Do I have, you know, they asked me, get of all these, all these questions. I said, no, no, no. And then uh, I hung up with them, and they said, somebody will be with you shortly. Then, about five minutes later, somebody from actually inside the urgent care called, read me, asked me all the same questions over again, and I said, no, 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 I don't have any, any um, you know, symptoms of coronavirus. And, and, so, and so they said, all right, well, somebody be out. So you stay in your car, somebody will be with you in a minute. And so I went to, I, I stayed in the car, and I was kind of like looking around, and I saw somebody coming out of the... Um, uh, uh, out of the office, out of the out of the urgent care, uh, with you know mask. I had a mask on and I had gloves on, you know, because I thought I was going to be going in. I didn't really think it through, so I thought I was going to be going in. So I was kind of all dressed for it. But I saw somebody coming out of the building with gl mask, gloves, face shield, you know, gown, you know, all geared up and everything else. And so you know, I you know turned the car on a little bit, rolled down the window. And instinctively, you know, like you do, you know, I'm sitting there like this, and I, and I kind of turn to hello, and immediately it was, you know, face forward. And so, you know, <laughs> so, and so I, you know, face forward, I got the same list of questions from, from this guy as I did from every, you know, from everybody else on the phone, you know, have, you know, asking me if I have symptoms of coronavirus. I said, no, 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 no. He said, what's wrong? And I said, well, you know, explain everything else, which, which said, I think it's a sinus infection. And he said, okay. And, and without saying anything, crams the you know thing to take my temperature in my ear you know like they do you know just you know very keep your head forward you know so still standing in the car and then he said all right we're gonna swab you for coronavirus and instantly if you've if you've not seen or experienced how they swab for coronavirus how they do the the, the covid test is it's like a long q-tip like about that long and they stick it in your nose and from what I could tell, it felt like they stuck it in my nose here, and then it shoved it in until it was somewhere in the back seat of the car, I think. And they, you know, squink it around in there, and they yank it out, and then they squink, push it, and shove it in the other nostril, and uh, all the way back, in the, and, um, you know, squink it back out. Uh, and 
then you know and he said do you have any questions i said well, well no i said i i said well, how long will this take to find out and he said about he said nine days and then he said well, but it sounds to me like you have a, a sinus infection so he called in a prescription i went and got the prescription and i'm doing a lot better i still feel a little bit not not 100 percent, but still pretty good um and also on friday even though he said nine days on friday i got the call back and i do not have uh the coronavirus so uh thank god for that um but so this is just uh, just just to say just to tell a little story of where I've been what's been going on uh, but like I said I'm feeling more or less great now so we're gonna start doing some videos again um, here kind of in the series that we started last week and we're gonna do some other ones kind of like I mentioned already we're gonna do a little tour of the chapel at the rectory and stuff like that um, just the artworks and the statues and things are in the chapel so um, I look forward to that but God bless and um, stay safe stay healthy um, and happy Easter Christ is risen, indeed he is risen.